was thinking, like, I hope he keeps shooting. Keep shooting. Um, you know, Dame, Dame did a good job tonight. Yeah, yeah, you guys are starting to see vintage Dame. I think he's starting to get his feet back under him. Um, people don't understand, you know, what it's like to come off injuries midseason and miss games and the conditioning. And you think about it, we're playing games every other day. There's not a lot of practices, so it's, there's not a lot of live action. It's just working out. You know, that stuff doesn't necessarily always translate. And then he comes back the week of, you know, uh, All Star, All Star City. You know, we, we go from playing Chris Paul to, to Steph to, to Russell. Those are his three elite point guards. So uh, he stepped up. He hit big shots. He hit shots from 40 feet. He hit contested shots, and he guarded tonight. So it was, it was a good all around game for him. And, and, you know, I was looking forward to him coming back in that fourth quarter. Look at looking like, Coach, come on, <laughs> give me some help. And uh, he, he came through. Is there kind of like a here we go again feeling when you, you, know, you see him hit one and kind of taps his wrist, nods his head, that kind of thing? Yeah, I, I mean, he had good art tonight. He had good, he had good, good pop in his, in his step uh, defensively. He was moving around screens well, and uh, he didn't really miss too many shots short, so I felt like he, he was in a good rhythm. Um, they do a good job in their ball screen coverages of getting out hedges, and their bigs can switch and, and guard pretty well on the perimeter so uh, that just means you got to extend your range a little bit and, and luckily he has he has in the in the gym range so what did you guys change in those last three minutes to kind of slow them down on defense uh, we changed up some of the pick and roll coverages we gave duran and, and russ some different looks some hard hedges and uh i don't think they were they were expecting it just because our our soft coverage is all night and the pick and rolls where they were able to get to their mid-range uh, jumpers so we changed that up a little bit and, and packed it in the paint When's the last time you guys practiced pick and roll coverage like that? We do have it. We have it. You have it? No, we have it. So do you, does it just tell you to blitz them a little bit more? Yeah, we. I mean, we, we worked on it in preseason, okay. so three months ago, two months ago. So, you know, we got some active bigs who are able to move. Uh, Plumley, I'm sure, you know, he remembers the college days of hard hedges and traps at Davis. You know, this is their first year here, so they, they're used to playing pick and roll defense similar to what we did in the last three minutes. So it wasn't a, a big change. It was just more about being aggressive and using their athleticism, and they did a good job. And Coach did a good job of trusting us with not a lot of preparation in the pick and roll.